Yo, 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 what is going on, guys? Today we are showing the Lost and Found. Pretty much ended up hitting on a size 11, personal size. And I did get a 6Y and a 7Y. I was lucky enough to hit on a ship to me option. The last option that I had was just a Foot Locker, the Flex app. I did get a men's size and a GS, and then I did get a, another exclusive access on the finish line. So I was lucky enough, last minute thing. Honestly, I took all L's on every platform, all the in-store raffles, all that stuff. So once I seen the charge late at night, I was like, oh, dude, I'm good. So lucky enough, I did hit on that on the personal size. I do want to double up, so I probably will be reselling those to double up on another size 11 for the men's size. But yeah, let's get into it and check them out. All right, guys, so pretty much, yeah, this is size 11 right here. And I did get this on uh, the ship to me option, so not too bad. I got lucky on that one. And yeah, it's crazy, guys. We've always been waiting for the special box. We've always been waiting for that extra exclusive little packaging. And here we have it now. It's actually pretty cool that we do get to see this now. Um, but yeah, everything about this this little collab of this uh, release is pretty cool with that little fake receipt that it comes with it's really nice and here we have it guys sneaker of the year what do you guys think yeah these things are really nice to be honest I don't have that 2015 pair so for me this is a must cop and uh, I'm actually really lucky to get these so it does uh, come with a little like creasing right there, as you guys can see. The other pair does have it a little bit more. But I mean, I'm not gonna return them for that little small detail, so. But yeah, guys, overall, it's a really nice shoe. It's one of the best out there, so. I honestly feel it's like sneaker of the year, pretty much. Something that you can actually obtain. Travis Scott's and all that, it's pretty hard to get, so. I mean, other than that, you know, it's just more of a hype shoe. But yeah, these are still doing pretty good. They're in the fours, almost high five, size 11, bigger sizes. So it's not too bad, but I do want to double up. I will sell the GS sizes to get another pair of this. So I could have one to rock and one to just stock out there. But yeah, let me know what you guys think about these. If these were a cop, easy cop. Um, if it was something that you guys wanted, was in your list, top three, top five on your list. Honestly, I do want to get the the lobster dunks also uh, that's that's honestly the pair that I think it's that and this top my top two favorite to be honest and uh, I do want to get the lobsters I might be uh, having to pay retail for them because I also took all L's on them but yeah here's the other pair you guys can see there's that little crease right there but I'm not worried about that but yeah, it does come with the two, two, uh, two laces, white and black. And it does have that little off-white, kind of little pinkish uh, tongue here. So that little vintage vibe, a little yellowy, but yeah, overall, it's a really nice shoe. I'm, I'm honestly like really happy about it. So let me know what you guys think about it. And, uh, Drop a comment down below if you guys got a W on it, you guys, you know, hit on it, let me know. I will be trying to get the lobster dunk, see how that goes, so I might have to pay resale for that. Because those things are not dropping anytime soon. But yeah guys, let me know what you guys think about them. If it was an easy call for you guys, you guys doubled up. Let me know what happened to you guys. And make sure, you know, you guys drop a comment and subscribe to the channel for some more content. Thanks guys.